we best friends were hanging out When the world went down in flames Living in a bunker now Full of And so there's this English girl sitting bunker. on a chair. She's like, are you tired of your poop smelling bad? And it's... <laughs> And it coming with you out of the bathroom? Well, then here's this new product, and you spray it on top of the water, and it seals in the scent. So even if you poo, it goes beneath the water, and the stench doesn't come up above the surface of the water. You know oh, what? Oh. I'll have to try Wait. that. Oh, oh, we're on. What's up, guys? Mm. Uh, welcome to Game Bunker. Uh, the world's been dead for I don't know how long at this point. Uh, and to celebrate. Uh, we're celebrate. playing Castle Shikigami 2. <laughs> Castle what? Uh, yes, I said it. Castle Shikigami 2. <laughs> so let's get into this. Risque. First of all, we're going to go to options. We're going to make it uh, real easy. It's a shmup? It's a shmup. Uh, but Some it's a shmup. Some people really hate that term. With a shoot shmup, short for shoot em up. Uh, we're going to do uh, a normal game. We're not good enough for extreme. <laughs> that was a weird pre menu to have to this other menu. Now, <laughs> who do we want to know more about? We got. Uh, Kotaru Kuga, we got Sayo Yuki, we got a whole suite of people. Uh, They're all unique, and the best part is they all have amazingly bad voiceovers. Oh, good. Well, who's the pink haired girl? Uh, yeah. Oh, Fumiko OV. Yeah, let's go with Fumiko. Now, are you guys ready for the most stimulating? New world, new order. Guess the rest failed. <laughs> mm. This sounds like like a like a fifty seven year old woman at a poetry slam. I may fight. <laughs> Eleven. Uh, so let me just bomb nothing. Oh, yeah, I that's uh, the, the that's controls. a good use of your bombs. Uh, so this this is a PS two shmup. It's also on PlayStation Network, which you can't access anymore because you know because you're all the dead. world is dead. And so you're a, a you're a witch on a broom. I'm a right witch now. on a broom. Playing some Quidditch. Uh, oh, I got hit. Like a fool. Oh, you lost all your money. And uh, one cool thing about this game is you can make like little what? little defenses anywhere I on the see. screen. That's, That's pretty a shield. Um, pretty the, exciting stuff. Who was that guy in your upper right hand corner? Was that like a butler? Or my something? butler? Was, <laughs> okay. Nothing nothing helps out more when you're riding a broom shooting things than a butler. And well, uh, and witches are known for having butlers. <laughs> <laughs> very true. Very true. <laughs> I want you guys to know that this game takes place in the far future of 2006. Wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wow, you're at the top. I'm the best. No one's ever gonna bring you down. Mm. Uh, there's two player, and in two player, there's unique uh, dialogue. Meaning, you get to stack up <laughs> oh, atrocious see. voice acting on top of it. You know, I forget what game it was. It was a Capcom shooter that was on the Dreamcast and uh, uh, Cannon Spike. Perhaps? Yeah, Cannon Spike, I believe it was, where single player was super serious and then multiplayer was very silly. <laughs> <laughs> like that whistling, Ozette. Uh huh. I'm Fumiko now. A lot of scarlet. What? <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> out. World order's gonna set the world on fire. Okay. Oh boy. You know what to do? <laughs> Was that a question? Beat him down and jump. I just started. What? <laughs> uh, come again? Well, I guess. Beat I'll him kill down you and now. start. <laughs> that's so confusing. <laughs> wow. Well. Yeah. So that's not even the best one. Uh, but I'll let you guys. I'll let you guys uh, see. So, oh, yeah, it's probably oh, oh, pretty rats. It's pretty like big Sonic the Hedgehog. You lost all your rings. Ringu. A pretty big mistranslation there, I gotta say. <laughs> and that's pretty much uh, this game. Sounds like it was translated by people that didn't have the best grasp of the English language. Mm -hmm. And voice actors who uh, <laughs> are straight out of acting school. And I died. <laughs> well, um, you know, good try. Uh, it's called Press Start. Sheesh. <laughs> Excess, do they Normal. exist anymore? Press start, Henry. There you there go. There you go. Now notice your four credits went down to two because you got to split up between you. I want to be. So uh, I recommend picking the first character. Kim Dae Jung. Dialogue. Kotaro Kuga. Nigi Gib. <laughs> I'm going to be Roger Sasuke. All right. Explosive mind, Shikibu. Roy, why are you here? <laughs> uh -huh. Damn, I missed. Why come here? What? <laughs> what? Evil, enemies, and Ko is here. What else? <laughs> what? I was judged. Fumiko's failed. 
<laughs> what? I understand. <laughs> I follow the story. He called him Roy when he showed up. <laughs> <laughs> now you notice uh, when you're glowing red, wow. that means you're you're just close enough to a shot for the game to say, hey, you're pretty good at this. You should uh, get some extra points. Maybe some coins while you're at it. <laughs> there were two. TVs were TVs <laughs> were tubes. TVs were you didn't a series watch no of TV, You watched the tube. <laughs> That's why a they call it the tube. boob tube. Well, that's also. Why do they call it a boob tube? Uh, I think because it's a very no. I every time. I, do, see, I'm trying to. Move what over there. are you even saying? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> now the boob. See, I believe the boob tube is just that. Like that was a '50s way of making fun of somebody. Like, shut up, you boob. Yeah. Like they were. Uh, like they were an idiot. <laughs> oh, so like a couch potato. Yeah. I actually have the manual here. Oh. Something you don't see in a lot of. Uh, well, modern games are dead, but or games game from bunkers, the yeah. recent era. Uh-huh. Uh huh. So, do you guys want to know more about who you're playing as? Yeah, please. So, Ryan, you're a young private detective <laughs> of H and K Detective Agency. Funny, because you look like a high school boy. He wears a unique school uniform and has many charms, oh. much like yourself. <laughs> has <Ryan>. many charms. <laughs> he controls the the beautiful human eating devil Zase Song <laughs> and traps his victims. <laughs> He plants bombs and uses them for his advantage. Oh boy! What he a also smart man. cannot stop arguing with Sayoyuki. So uh, yeah, that's that's your story. That's your motivation. He right? can't stop using him for his advantage. <laughs> <laughs> he just can't. He <laughs> like, tells him really like, "Come cannot. on, buddy, stop using him for your advantage." And he's like, mm. <laughs> "So well, Henry, your character, there. Roger Sasuke, not, right. also known as Roy." <laughs> so yeah, reason. he just called him Roy. He's, he didn't say Roger. <laughs> Simply put, he is an American ninja. <laughs> ah. <laughs> All right, wait. Cool. Let's let's. We gotta hear this dialogue. It'll be good. Okay. Ooh la la! Such lovely guests. Okay. My body's beautiful. <laughs> Wanna take a look? Sure. Uh. No. <laughs> 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 Two of a kind. <laughs> Shall we fight? <laughs> Wow, <laughs> they're talking <laughs> over each other. <laughs> what a tacky name while he's... Uh, so Raj Sasuke, once upon a time, he stayed at Kotaru's house. He is a good friend of Kuga. He's a very smart guy and loves Japan. Oh, good to know. But he's an American ninja. He is an American ninja, and the, in that he cannot American be American ninjas. You guys ever see the film American Ninja? Uh, no, I can't say that I have. Well, I've, I've, seen, uh, I've seen Beverly Hills what? Ninja. Like little brother. What? <laughs> Jesus. Nice and last. Bye. Hang in there. <laughs> Not little bro. Not little bro. Old enough to vote. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, old it means he's at least 18 years old, Lucas. <laughs> Well, if you were the if you were the voice actor, so if you were the voice actor and they handed you that script, would you say like, hey, maybe I can make some grammatical changes to this if if you like, and pro bono, yeah. or would you just read it and say, oh, give oh, me my pitch? We both died at the same time. Damn All right, it. continue on, guys. I want to see what, what uh, what's to come. Anyways, well, I think the problem is that the like the director. I am guessing this didn't have an American director. I'm guessing the voice director and voice direction Access was probably games. all done in Japan. That could be. And so the director's in charge, no matter how much they don't know English. <laughs> and so <laughs> they call the shots. Yeah. Well, Wait, do you recall like Mega Man 8 and Mega Man, uh, Mega X4? Man. We gotta and Mega find Man X4? Wily. <laughs> yeah. Now, honestly. Those games make Mega Man, this game makes Mega Man X4 seem like very, very good, very well made. But there, were but there were lines in it of just like, what am I fighting for? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, me and Ryan have a, a favorite, a personal favorite from Devil May Cry, which is, I should have been the one to fill your dark, dark soul, soul with light. But the, what apparently I, I had learned from Did You Know Gaming, mm -hmm. or, or Did You Know uh, Come on, I had no warning there. Game over! Oh, game over. <laughs> game over, wait a moment. <laughs> later, ner later, nerd. Jeez. So now I wonder what happens to the cutscenes. Is it just Ryan, or I'm the better is Roger still alive? 
You are an American ninja, right? Mm -hmm. If I've ever seen one in all my days. <laughs> oh, but anyway, the, the reason was that they, it was, it was Japanese voice actors who could do who could speak in English for their roles because ah. they were filming it in they they recorded it all in Japan so they're just like well, let's just get Japanese voice actors who speak English <laughs> and that'll be just as good. So did they pick the same voice actor for the Japanese and English dubbing? No, no, it was a different actor, but all just ones they could do in <laughs> studio. Like, ooh, much so to the chagrin just, of an American audience. Yeah. Well, they didn't realize so they're well. That's probably why they're like. Um, you know, Mega Man had this girly voice because, like, well, we have a woman record Mega Man's voice in Japanese. Why not just do it? Like, <laughs> hey, Bart Simpson on The Simpsons is a woman. Well, that's why Goku's voice in Japanese sucks because they just stuck with the voice actress who did it when Goku was a little boy. Like, so even when he's a teen, it's still when, even a when woman he is a forty-year-old father, he still he still sounds exactly. <laughs> 90% the same as how he sounded when he was young Goku in the original first episode. That's too funny. That is got to be bizarre. Step up to the plate here. I'm going to show you, I've gotten to level 3 of this game. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't mean to brag. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to pick your boy Kuga again. And what you're going to see is probably one of the most bizarre and legendary uh, examples of bad voice acting. We don't need it. We don't need it. Okay. Maybe it's time to play hero. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come on! Who's he talking to? <laughs> himself, himself in the mirror. He's hyping himself up. <laughs> well, it's the same. I heard this interesting, uh, this interesting story on this old uh, podcast called uh, Eight Four Play, mm. where they four play. Eight Four Play. <laughs> that Eight Four is this. Uh, Eight four, uh, they're a localization team. The mm -hmm. the type of people you hire to make sure something like this doesn't happen <laughs> to avert the calamity of what is right. Castle that fancy Shigami ghost you got? So that's my uh, human eating demon. Uh, and what's neat about this guy is he could basically just hold it down and the whole stage. So it's really just itself. about dodging. And then he also pulls the money towards you. Exactly. Oh my that god. That's a little too easy. Why didn't you tell us to play him? Um, I really should have done that uh, if I was a good friend, but... Uh... <laughs> Hi, what a cute boy. <laughs> Interested in my... God, what is up with her? <laughs> Not interested. Oh, mm. an interesting turn. Oh, you're into that. <laughs> what? <laughs> I like girls. Now, <laughs> now just. Yeah, it's about just. My name is Ko. That's beating down evil. Beating down evil. Stop bothering me. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got two choices. A. Jesus. <laughs> caught. Caught, baby. Beaten. Either way, a woman's getting beaten. You're an idiot. You're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. so ridiculous. And what's even better is the the dialogue cutscenes are in English, uh, but then they didn't dub over the in-game screams of the characters, so it's still in, in Japanese. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> so there's a bit of a disconnect. Oh, oh. no! <laughs> oh, no! Go home. <laughs> Regret this. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, uh. And now I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so pissed. Stop making trouble. Who are you saying this to? I'm kicking your butts. <laughs> oh my god. You got two choices. <laughs> beaten then caught, or caught then beaten. <laughs> oh he's my carrying god. a backpack the whole time, but he's a he's a I think I'm a, a high school detective. Student. He uh, said he was a detective. I'm a boy though. detective. Well, the manual can say something, and there's a very good chance it's not true at all. Oh, boy. Uh, what was your point about David Hayter? Yeah, uh, just that Kiefer Sutherland's not better. Like, no, he's not trying all that hard. It probably cost a heck of a lot more. Yeah, it, if, if they're going to replace somebody after 15 years, which is basically like forever in video game time, then it better be a real improvement. But when it's just like, nah, this guy's more famous, <laughs> who cares? Like... <laughs> 
Yeah, that's not a sell. Like no one who didn't care about Metal Gear before Kiefer is going to mm. suddenly say, "Oh, I've watched 24." Let me buy yeah. Metal Gear. Solid. But he's also just like he's just Kiefer. Like he's not doing really a voice or anything or acting more. It's he's, just him talking. Well, just he like had a, a few moments where he kind of had a little bit of that like bravado, grit, or yeah. whatever. Well, also he barely talked in Ground Zero. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my sweet, sweet coins. My coins. Uh, yeah, I feel like once you've had the same voice actor for a long enough time, the only reason to replace them is if they die. <laughs> that is like no yeah. other. Well, or in the case of what Michael Ironside. Well, he got too old, yeah, and he, he couldn't do the. Well, I mean, they say they mocapped Sam Fisher, but it's like. Well, he's supposed to be what, like a like you a better not 40, die. forty year old dude, but Ironside's like eight hundred years old. He's he's very. Old, <laughs> oh, eight hundred. Well, he's dead now, but he's an old time for another, <laughs> another winner. Oh, man. <laughs> this will be good. That's it, villain. <laughs> what a cool line. You're <laughs> Thank you. Nice. I think we could be best friends. I am Dundian, keeping it a fool-free zone. Keeping it a fool-free. <laughs> My name is Ko, and I'm beating down That's evil. That's his thing, beating down evil. I'm not taking excuses. See, he ad libbed there. Yeah. You're very angry. A real hothead. Thank you. I like that. It'll be an honor to beat you. Instead of meet you? An honor to beat you? Well, right. see, and he says it'll be an honor to beat you. So, <laughs> you, we were saying, wow, wouldn't the voice actor like re record this? Like, maybe the line on screen is exactly what they were told to say. They're like, this I is, can't this do is this. This is words. Like you can't. <laughs> you can't make I me can't do this. I can't write this. I can't say these words without without all of the words this sentence needs. <laughs> oh my uh, god! Wee! Wow! Ooh, ah! Oh! Oh! That's why we were chosen by the cat. <laughs> what? What, what are you talking about? <laughs> okay. You don't recognize it. And then he uh, blows up. <laughs> That's it. You don't recognize it. Goodbye. <laughs> He's flying through the. How is he flying through the air? By the way, it's a question I haven't asked myself. It's quite a high school student's ability. Say. <laughs> very tip, very typical of high school mm. students. In Japan. Well, you've been to Japan. Yeah. <laughs> you, you know what it's like. Outside, there's you know what it's like. Kids flying. <laughs> <laughs> they, they don't use school buses, they just fly. But it, uh, it is crappy when like the stars of Mass Effect get a pittance for well, doing amazing work in a million selling game. True, but also for the, well this is rapid, well, was rapidly changing, but they were also just doing the voice chunk for the most part. It's mm -hmm. true. Now it of course obviously started to change, we're a lot more than we're doing full body acting as well. Well, um, compared to what they're doing in uh, what they're doing in a cartoon, what you have to like, if they're just doing a cartoon or even a movie, like the number of lines you're saying compared to the number of lines you're expected to say in a video game, like pretty different. Mm -hmm. So, are, have you guys noticed that this is a cool match three puzzle yeah. going on? This is uh, I've never seen anything like this in a shmup. It is pretty it's interesting pretty that you have to then do it as you're oh. getting shot. Uh, <laughs> shot out here. That was like way too many things to watch at once. Yeah. Like, <laughs> it's a lot going on. Uh, but in any case, we did it. <laughs> I'm old enough to vote. <laughs> <laughs> Not little brother. <laughs> My sexuality favors justice, <laughs> not women. Uh, hey, here's some trivia for you. We were up? talking about how the button, like, you you expected X to be shoot, and it's actually bomb. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you know why those buttons are backwards in a lot of Japanese games? Well, let's not call it backwards. Let's call no, it different. Okay, do you know why those buttons are not what they are in American <laughs> Why? Games? Why is that? Well, uh, at least for the PlayStation, the PlayStation was designed in Japan and of the Japanese idea that the that X means bad. Like X means no. Like or a bad. cross. Like yeah. Cross. Okay. Boo. Uh, that's it's racked up. Saying. Well, I mean, while circle means yes, good, ding, mm. circle over screen, you did it right. And so, if you wanted to choose something or do the normal thing, you would hit the circle. Be like, yeah, cool. Huh. Let's hear what. Yeah, I remember that. Bay Aja and Say Aja. Ah, <laughs> new boy. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Big bro, he shouts like we do. We do. He's the same kind as we are. Oh boy, <laughs> that's supposed to be an Asian. Shouting for anger. I don't know. This is awful. We're not alike. I'm a hero. And I'm done. Well, I'm done. <laughs> See you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Heroes help society, not make trouble. Uh, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can get behind How that. How smart! <laughs> now we fight. <laughs> now I'll kill you. Uh, anyways, you were saying, Henry. No, so, okay, if that's the case, I can get behind. You know, X being bad and Circle being good. But why would they put Circle on the right side instead of where your thumb just naturally goes on the control? Well, I was just playing a. Uh, and any, I mean, oh god! Uh, you know what? I can't say it. Ah! Hey, do you know that in old NES games, <laughs> like the A and B button were kind of backwards too? Like you, in in Japanese rules, like when we played that slow down. When we played that Super, <laughs> when we played Super Mario Brothers two on here, remember the jump button were backwards. I right. think the rightmost button is also expected to be the correct button. Mm. Not the lower, yeah, the button closest to you. Well, I, mean, I first remember the whole like circle being your choose this button. Uh, like in uh, any of the Final Fantasy games on PlayStation, uh, it was that way. Where a oh. circle would select and X would back you out of a screen. What the? They just kiss. So they, they uh. ki no, they kill each other. <laughs> the fool is strong. <laughs> yep. Don't say fool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, easy mode's finished. Well, guys, I mean, clearly we're not good enough to get past that, so. No. I guess uh, I guess it's time Let's to see, wrap up. I oh, want to see sorry. one more start of a two-player match yeah, yeah. conversation. Why don't you do that? Ryan, jump back in there. And I'll tell you more about the characters you're Let's playing. Let's see. Let's pick two different... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pick Kim uh, Jean. I'm going with Sayo Yuki. Kim Dijon is... Kim Dijon... Oh. Just made it. Are you Kim? <laughs> yes, I am. My friend asked me to help you. She asked you a question. Your friend? The wish of a man of seven worlds. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> There's not a lot of time till the castle goes down. Oh my god. Okay. What? <laughs> Is Kim De Jong supposed to be seen? Is he Korean? Is, is uh, he read as Korean? I don't know. Oh, well, Henry, let me tell you. A Korean fighter. Yeah. At that's... night, he is a fighter. But See. during the day, he teaches young children Taekwondo. Uh, now, one day, one of uh, Kim's Japanese students was killed, and he closed his dojo to seek the killer. He oh, wears man, a trench fun. coat and carries a guitar case with a sword inside. So that, I mean, that we are seeing that on screen, which is kind of yeah, cool. I see. It doesn't explain why he's flying and shooting uh, laser shurikens, but... <laughs> uh, and I'm your standard Shinto priestess. Yes, your backstory, Henry, is... Uh, <laughs> this is how the sentence starts. Comes from a strong religious home that dates back to the war era. Okay. <laughs> oh. An expert in using spiritual power. Okay. She is 16. I mean, obviously. Right. But because of her nature, she has never gone to school. <laughs> she uses what the Yata. What nature is that? I don't know. Is the Yata spiritual bird and is a battle expert. She has left her town by train and her arrived at Tokyo Station. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I am not making this up. This is and her the arrived. actual manual included with the. US no, I want to know is the boss of the first level going to ask her, do you want my body? And <laughs> well, yeah, we, we, we should see that. <laughs> Oh, what that game? Uh, what that game? <laughs> now I'm talking like the characters in this. Anyway, uh, it was one of the Ace Attorney games where they just, they're all, they're, they're clearly having like a tea ceremony and drinking Here and we eating go. sushi, but they <laughs> but won't having... cop to it. <laughs> I mean, everyone knows. The sad jihad. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> I'm not a weapon. Okay, I like that. <laughs> An archetypal evil you brought here. Okay. All kingdoms have dirty little secrets. <laughs> that looks like he's screaming with his eyes closed. <laughs> Victims shouldn't be annoyed. Sayo, ready? <laughs> Victims shouldn't be annoyed. <laughs> this is so confusing. Now, don't you wish? 
all boss fights were like this in all games where you get a full dialogue beforehand and a full dialogue after. I think most games are like that. I mean, you know, back in the day, yeah, PlayStation that, 2 era. You just, you oh, Aria! Oh. Yeah, they're still, you're right, they're still speaking in Japanese. Men fight for weapons, and that's crazy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Old fashioned ideas, not anymore. <laughs> the new age is coming soon. It'll be quality over blood. What? Uh, <laughs> okay, I, I could interpret that as like your bloodline doesn't determine who you are. Sayo didn't even get to say anything. <laughs> she didn't say oh much. All right. right. Wait, we got one more dialogue part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Man, we're just average. <laughs> you. Story you. of my life. <laughs> what was the wish? <laughs> Sorry, not Ko. What? <laughs> Oh, is that so? <laughs> of course. <laughs> okay. What? This is non. Don't be upset. Ko's trying to join us. That's nice of him. <laughs> Don't be upset by this nonsensical exchange. <laughs> I agree with it entirely. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. That'll do it for Castle Shikigami 2. But uh, you guys, you the viewers, asked us some questions about the future. And uh, using our patented time travel technology, where those comments from YouTube and GamesRadar.com go into a time capsule and we dig it up here. Okay. Uh, I actually have those questions right here. So let me ask you guys. Um, yeah. Jack the Kingsmith 4 wants to know. All right. Uh huh. How do you guys plan to repopulate Earth? And have any of you paired up yet due to sexual frustration <laughs> needing to feel, slash needing to feel wanted? Well, I thought we were under agreement that it is actually impossible for us to repopulate the Earth. Yeah. I mean, male pregnancy technology has been explored. Well, but none movies. of us had our pregnancy pods with us when we got trapped <laughs> on it. Well, that's and, the problem. All right, got to, to tell I, you what my plan is, guys. What's that? So, we talked about those gerbils we have downstairs, right? <laughs> now, oh, God. <laughs> now, my plan with them is that they're going to have to inherit the earth. Like, they will keep breeding they're breeding the next and spreading out. They're the species. So I'm trying to teach them now, and hopefully I will be seen as their god. Ah. So I will at least be immortal in that way. Um, wow, that's But clever. you guys can't go to the church, because I, I don't want to confuse them. <laughs> I'm the god here, not you guys. You're, you're the deity. We are just, we're the devil. And if you guys try to start training like cockroaches to see you as a god, then I'm going to have to declare a jihad on you guys. <laughs> A trick-free weapon or something. Yeah. <laughs> um, now, uh, John Peppers wants to know, how many people did you sacrifice to save yourselves? Oh, God. I, I think it's somewhere in the hundreds. Hundreds, um, really? Well, it's, it's that Henry, we were hanging out at Henry's house, and people were running through the streets screaming. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we had a bunker, and people were asking, can we join? And we said, well, how good of a gamer you are. <laughs> are you? And uh, if they said, you know, that it's not time to talk about video games, we just shut them out. Look, you gotta do what you gotta do when shit goes down like that. Yeah. You know, even if that means killing hundreds of people. Well, I also said we, we have enough games for hundreds of people, but we don't have enough water. So <laughs> we gotta keep it to how much water we have. And which you can is only. Barely enough for three. And you can really only drink. Like two. You can only drink so much of your own urine. Yeah. Well, so, let's, that's debatable. <laughs> I mean, it is sterile. I mean, well, I've acquired a taste for <laughs> Henry's specifically. <laughs> we we just trade just urine. You use it like a water day. tap. It's you like, say, you fill know, her up, buddy. Yeah, it's like it's well, a I have, symbiotic relationship. Yeah, I have sulfur water. Henry's got a little bit of cleaner mountain water. <laughs> Switch off. <laughs> now, this isn't a question, but uh, Kijib Kijin says, "I hope Senpai notices Henry today. <gasps> Consider Henry noticed." Mm -hmm. And uh, lastly. Uh, we have a question from a kind hobo asking, <laughs> did Tom and the rest of the League of Legends team in the office ever win an LCS? No. <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> Even if they were the only people to have survived in my way of We'd three still of us. lose, yeah. <laughs> we, we can barely win against the bots. <laughs> Unbelievable. Happens. Well, that's gonna do it uh, for no. this episode of Game Bunker, but Ryan, yeah. what is the next game we're gonna play? Oh man, we have an extra special treat oh, yeah? for next uh, next episode, and not a single one of us has played this game. My god, it's like Octodad all over again. It is, actually. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna be playing Goat Simulator 2014. Oh my, oh, yeah. that so, sounds like a winner. 
Well, that's what we have to look forward to. That sounds good to me. Um, I hope nothing sexual happens while we're playing Goat Simulator. Uh, I can't make any promises. <laughs> now, <laughs> what I want you guys to do at home is tell your friends, tell your family, tell your acquaintances, tell your coworkers, tell your pets that you saw three best friends uh, playing games in the future. Yes. And uh, ask us questions about the future because we lived it. We can tell you what goes down and maybe you can prevent it from happening. Mm. Uh, but until then, we'll catch you guys next week and always fight for justice. Not girls. <laughs> <laughs> so if you'd like to see some old game grade our stuff back when our coworkers were still alive, check out these videos here. And don't forget to subscribe right down in this general area. And leave a comment and tell your friends about how you saw three best friends from the future spend a transmission. Mm -hmm.